Hello. How are we doing today? Hi, Tatiana. Thanks for having us. <laughs> Thank you for being here. I am loving season two of The Wilds, but I would just like to know, how are we feeling morally speaking? As we're going into season two, we've been witnessing these, exper these experiments from your, pers your character's perspectives. Right. What are you feeling right now, Troy? Um, you know, it, it picks up from season one. I'm, I'm still morally conflicted. Um, it's, it's, it's definitely now I'm throwing in a whole new set of characters into the, into the mix. Um, but you know, Dean has some, some, some things that's, that's going to be pretty interesting to see, um, this season. Um, but you know, overall he, he has children, you know, he's, 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 he could empathize with the kids a little bit. Um, he was once a teenager himself. Um, and, you know, it's, it's, it weighs at him. So you're going to see that kind of pressure this season. And um, I'm excited for you to see it. Absolutely. And you, David? Yeah, there's two islands and there's two different things. And there's two, they're compared. It's just, it's really, really cool once things start unraveling, when you learn that, like, you know, as different as, as, you know, uh, teenage boys and girls are, you start to find out how very, very similar they are and what some of the boys do and, and who some of the boy, what they end up doing is really, really going to surprise you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Exciting. Exciting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, uh, for our mastermind Gretchen, how would you say each of you, um, re your relationship to her or your views about her evolve over the course of the season, whatever you can, oh, that's, Troy. That's, 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 that's a heavy one. Uh, see, you did your homework on that one. Huh? Um, <clears throat> I think Gretchen's intentions in the beginning were very, very, um, noble um in in her mind and in her vision you know um she's on course to do what she thinks needs to be done right someone from the outside looking in may question that and my character happens to do that so as this season season two continues i'm still questioning and i'm still observing and i'm noticing things that i don't think that are right so, you know, it, it, and I, I present that to her in certain ways throughout the season <clears throat> where the last couple of shows really kind of like steps up and, and, and I, you know, it's, it's, it's not so much a confrontation, but it's like, come on now, let's, 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 let's think about what we're doing here. You know what I mean? So, um, but throughout the season, it's going to be, you're going to sprinkle in some of those, um, some of those questions. Mm. Um, and, uh, you know, speaking from, from, from my point of view, I think um, David's, David's character does as well. Um, so, yeah, but, but that's just. What, is, what does David think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, 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 it's all about the research. I, I think, you know, when, when, when Dan, when my character decided to join Gretchen's team, and to, you know, manipulate or observe or learn. Um, I think all along that he thought, okay, this is a great way to study, you know, uh, the teenagers in an environment where they're forced to connect, they're forced to survive, they're, for, they're forced to, to um, be with each other. I think for him, it starts as, information gathering. And then as it goes on, he starts to question, you know, the links that we're putting these kids through in order to gain this information. So I think there is a little crisis of conscience, you know, somewhere along the way. Yeah. Understandably so. Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you both so much. Uh, you guys are great. And so is the wilds. Thank you. <laughs>